Today, Kevin and I are gonna try these Nabisco Belvita uh, breakfast soft bake uh, banana. This is the banana bread. They're breakfast biscuits is what they're called. Um, and they had different ones. They had cinnamon, oats and chocolate, and mixed berry. But Nicole requested that we try the banana bread. Uh, they were $2.79 at Meijer. And what else did we try that was the banana bread that I absolutely Love. The heart shape. The um, no, 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 no. no. The, they're Quaker. They're Quaker. I've only been able to find them at Target. They're yeah, absolutely yeah. wonderful. So I'll see how these compare. Uh, these are, they're only 190 calories, which I think are less than the Quaker. Uh, da, da, da. How many do you get in a package? Five. You get five. Okay, they come like this. Um, we planned, they don't have any instructions on them for to heat them, so we're gonna look at it and see if. It if feels we, soft enough where you, you could eat it. I think we should try it both ways. It says it contains 20% daily value of fiber, seven grams of fat per serving, 11 grams delicious whole grains, a uh, good source of B vitamins. Contains no high fructose corn syrup, partially hy hydrogenated oils. That smells really good. Uh, contains no artificial flavors or sweeteners. It's a little more dense than uh, what you would expect. Set these back. Kind of fell apart. I immediately taste the banana. You can almost taste it where you put it in your mouth. Mm -hmm. And you know what? I'm going to say the first thing that came to my mind because it's just the truth. And Kevin might feel completely different. The flavor of the banana. It's going to sound so weird. Tastes like the baby food banana. It, um, and I think the I reason is because it's real, it's a real, but it's fresh banana, and I think that's why, just because it's real. I only put it in for like eight seconds because it was a small piece, but... Mm -hmm. It didn't change much. I like it better warm. I do too, just because it adds that warmth to it. But it, flavor wise, I don't think it took away. Sometimes the flavor goes away a little bit when you heat them up. I don't really think it happened with this one. Um, they're kind of dry mm -hmm. when you first eat them. That's my biggest complaint. The flavor is good. They're very um, oaty kind of tasting, which you would expect out of this kind of bar. But they're they're very oh, they almost like they're almost like banana flavored oatmeal um, to me. Mm -hmm. You don't think so? No, I, I can agree with that. Yeah. They're good. I don't know that I would eat these all the time, though. Um, it, 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 once you've had the Quaker brand, then you would not like these. I, I, they're okay. They're edible. If someone gave me one at their house, I wouldn't turn it down. I'm not going to go out and buy these again, no. though. And I, I don't, I'm not really interested at all in trying the other flavors of them. I'm just not. Um, <laughs> I'm done. I'm, I'm, I'm fin <laughs> well, you know, it's just when once you find something that is so good, right. you know it's out there. You know it's good. You know you can get it. I know that there is a also a Quaker uh, cinnamon one. Well, why wouldn't I get that after trying this? Why wouldn't I get that one, knowing that it's really, really, really good? So I just this was okay, but um, it just doesn't do it for me. If you have a choice, uh, then you should find the Quaker ones. And I will put the exact name of that <laughs> um, in a caption under here because I just cannot think of it uh, for some reason. And I even showed it in my favorites, my monthly, my mo May monthly favorites. I even showed a box of it. Um, they they're just they're just awesome. Um, so anyway, these were edible but not awesome. I agree. So, thanks for watching.